All right, guys, continuing to dig through finding German locks in my naughty bucket. This is an Abus. I don't know the model number on this one. It has nothing on it other than their logo. Very nice uh, Yale style keyway. Got that nice curve. Uh, I'm going to pick from that right ledge right over here. And that means I'm going to go ahead and put my tension wrench down at the bottom there. That way I won't get in my way. Perfect fit. Um, these are nice locks for a couple reasons. First of all, they are usually spool, full of spools. So if you're looking for a good spool trainer, this is a good start. This is atypical. Again, there's no model number or anything on these keys, so I really have no idea. It's a five pinner, but this is very atypical. This is, it doesn't get better than this. If you're looking, if you're allowed to pick out your own key, your own bidding, this is, this is the one. Grab this one. But it does work beautifully. It is, as I said, a used lock, but not much. There's no corrosion or anything on it. Let's go ahead and clamp it up and see if we can't get it picked. All right, as I said, I'm going to use that bottom of the keyway. And I've got the microphone very close to the lock. I'm going to get it just a little bit closer. Maybe you guys will be able to hear. I'll try not to bump that with my finger. Maybe you guys can hear what's going on. I will use a, it's called a Tron, well, only because I've seen the bidding on that key. So I'm, it's a 25,000, it's from Sparrows. It's got a nice little rise on it. And I find this is a pretty good uh, key to use, or I'm sorry, key, oh, yeah, it is almost like a key. A good pick to use against Abus locks. All right, whoops. I'm trying not to bump the microphone for you guys wearing headphones. All right, light tension all the way in. And start feeling around. See if we can get find the binder. Get us a fault set started. I think that's a little bit of counter rotation. It feels like on three. Got a little click on him. Counter rotation on two. <laughs> well. They're good trainers. I didn't know this one would be quite that easy. But anyway, there you go, the Abus. If you're looking for a good training lock for spools, usually it gives you a lot more practice than that. Try to find a bidding like this, but in this case, it really didn't seem to help this guy. Anyway, thanks for your time, guys. Stay safe. Stay legal. Abus, thanks for sending me the easy one.